Bochia is a perfect fit for hospitals and other life safety applications. A vital part of administering a life safety system is device monitoring and system health reporting. The Vochia interface provides a clear, at-a-glance feedback of the health of all devices. It employs sophisticated mechanisms that make the devices self-monitoring for availability and fault detection. This ability to have system faults detected and reported in a timely manner allows any issues to be diagnosed and resolved, which in turn will minimise system downtime. Also this means an operator can detect a fault before the system is expected to perform but found to be in a compromised state. Vochia makes this process simple by providing real-time feedback to the user. This can be done via the software interface, a web interface, email notifications, activity logging, as well as physical indicators on various devices. Vochia also employs a colour scheme which indicates the health of devices and can alert the operator immediately if the system requires attention. The system I have here is fully functioning and all devices are available as shown by an overall green layout. Vochia shows anything an operator should be aware of in yellow and anything critical to system operations in red. If I unpatch the secondary network connection to my amplifier, this would automatically be indicated by the device status changing from green to red. By using the reporting and logging features of OCHIA, the nature of faults can be quickly established. Once a fault occurs with a device, by opening the device properties and navigating to the alarms and logs tab, detailed information on the nature of the fault can be seen. Devices in a Vochia system are monitored right from the microphone capsule to the output of the amplifier and can even be monitored right through to the end of the speaker line using an ELD1 end of line device. Any devices that are part of a compliant emergency system provide dual network ports. That way if one interface becomes unavailable, the emergency system is not compromised before the fault can be resolved. As mentioned previously, I've unpatched the secondary network connection to my amplifier. The fault I'm seeing tells me there's a problem with the secondary network interface. Seeing as this amplifier participates in the emergency system, I'm also being warned the severity of this error is critical. This should be attended to immediately. Any faults or alarms with the device will instantly get moved to the top of this report. In the lower portion of the device, alarms and logs window is the device log. This section provides device level feedback of events. We can see the exact time the network interface alarm occurred, and if I plug the connection back in, the exact time the connection is re-established again. In addition to the device log, there's a system-wide log. This reports all activity occurring on the Vochia network, including zone information, paging events, device availability, configuration updates, Vochia text protocol activity, email notifications, and all emergency activity. Again we can see where the secondary connection to the amplifier was first reported bad and then when it came good again. Many facilities such as hospitals require a historical log of system activity to be kept for liability and transparency purposes. The logger is able to be archived to the computer effortlessly using the export function. Having an MS1 message server in the system provides many extra benefits for system maintenance. As mentioned previously, email reporting can be configured so the IT or security department know about any faults or alarm without needing to monitor the system software interface. Email reporting can be configured from immediately to a daily, weekly or monthly summary and the reporting source is customised. The MS1 also acts as a central repository for device configuration. In case a Vochia device fails, a replacement can be connected using the same device ID and it will retrieve its configuration automatically. This makes device replacement a simple and extremely fast process in regards to monitoring emergency devices in a Vochia system. The LSI 16 Life Safety Interface has a built-in web browser. The emergency zone states, paging microphones, current fault states, active logs and network statistics can be viewed. Once the route to the LSI 16 network is configured, the potential to remotely monitor the emergency system from a browser-enabled phone, tablet or a computer is possible. With Vochia's system health monitoring and logging features, managing a paging or life safety system has never been so fast and easy.